And another big story right now, a tragedy in Tempe after two young children were found murdered inside their apartment. Ma'am, you're here on two charges of murder in the first degree, both class one felonies. The bodies of the young children were found Saturday. Now their mother, U.E. Inoue, faces charges of first degree murder. Good evening, everyone. I'm Kariba Devine. And I'm Mark Curtis. We do want to warn you that this story is upsetting. It's graphic and it contains disturbing content. Team Tools' Erica Stapleton is live at Lower Buckeye Jail. And Erica, first, any new insight into what led to these heinous attacks? Hey guys, Yui Inoue has a history of mental health issues, violence, and even allegations of kidnapping, according to court records. A warning again, this story is graphic. Both of these victims fought for their lives against their mother. Nine-year-old Mia Inoue and her seven-year-old brother Kai, both students at Kyrene Del Cielo Elementary School, found dead inside their apartment covered in blood under a blanket. I mean, how can there be closure in something like this? Their mother, Yui Inoue, charged with their murders. The weapon, police say, is a meat cleaver. Both children had numerous defensive wounds on their hand. Tempe police say Inoue drove to the police station herself Saturday morning and told officers that voices told her to kill her kids. But hours earlier, Tempe police had visited the apartment for a domestic disturbance. She had an argument with her husband. The suspect had threatened her husband with a meat cleaver. After that call, the husband left the apartment, leaving Inoue with their two kids. Inoue told police she went to bed with the kids and woke up to see blood, but told police she didn't remember hurting them, even exclaiming in court that she didn't do it. Uh, um, I, I did not kill anybody. Through a Japanese translator, a prosecutor explains Inoue has ties to China and Japan. As for her history in Arizona, Chandler police say Yui Inoue was connected to an incident back in March in which charges for aggravated assault on an officer were submitted to the county attorney's office. The case is still open, so they couldn't provide more details. Two days after that incident, a court docket shows someone by the same name had a court-ordered mental health evaluation. Court records also show Inoue is accused of stabbing her son with scissors in the past, although a police report was never filed. These children were helpless, Your Honor, and did everything they could to fight their mother. Yui Inoue is being held here at the Lower Buckeye Jail on a $2 million bond. She's due back in court this week. We're live in Phoenix. Erica Stapleton, 12 News. All right, Erica.